Hi, Rick McLean from Empire Machinery. Today I'm here to talk to you about our 88-ton uh, uh, Derma IW80 hydraulic iron worker. Uh, it's 80 metric ton, which is, equates to uh, 88 imperial tons. Uh, it's dual operator, so two operators can operate it at the same time for punching or for uh, angle, flat bar, round, or, or notching at the other end. You've got five stations. You've got your punch station here, uh, which is, um, again, 88 tons, inch and 9 sixteenths through 9 sixteenths. You've got an 11 and 3 quarter inch throat, uh, so it's a nice deep throat. You've got a 5 by 5 by half angle shear. You've got an 18 inch bar shear that will do 18 inches of 5 eighths or 12 inches of 3 quarter. And then your coper notcher here, a rectangular notcher, will, is uh, 2 by 3 and a half and it'll do uh, 15 30 seconds, which is just under half an inch. Uh, the round and square bar shear, inch and three quarter max uh, for both round and square. You've got gauging tables at every station. Uh, so on your, your punch end, you've got a uh, rear stop and a side stop here. So uh, if you're setting up for a repetitive job, uh, you've got a piece of plate that where the hole's gotta be in the same spot all the time. Uh, it's ideal for that. You got side gauging here on the flat bar shear, and uh, same uh, here on the uh, the notcher for those repetitive jobs. On the punch end, you've got a swing away stripper that's adjustable for height up and down. It comes with multiple um, die and punch holders, uh, four different size punches and dies. You've got a quick change uh, punch and uh, a quick change die. It just lifts out, put, pops back in, and then you've got a side uh, locking nut here. Neat job on your punching. Another really nice feature on this machine is the electric backstop here. Uh, what it does is uh, if you had a repetitive run of either uh, angle, flat or round or square bar, uh, you can set this up so that when you push your piece through, you don't have to hit the foot pedal every time. It'll just trip every time you, uh, you hit it. So I'm going to set it up here on the flat bar portion.